A nation in turmoil, the pandemic, economic uncertainty, isolation. We could all use a little bit more inspiration these days. A moment in our busy lives to just feel better. There's a reminder of that in downtown Boise. And the next time you're there, look around. You'll find it. Here's Kim Fields with the story. In an unexpected location, around the corner in a small alley in downtown Boise, a reassuring message. The message keeping your future alive is, is just that, right? Keep, keep it going. You know, you, you, there's, there's more to, there's more that comes after, you know, if you have a long day, you know, there's another day and there, there's, there's going to be more opportunity for you to, to make, you know, your, your day better, your, your future better. And it starts sometimes with small steps. Mural artist Bobby Gatton kept the message simple. Just four words. The deeper inspiration, he says, is found in the details. Just, hey, there's this happy girl, little girl that, you know, there's hope. You know, there's hope. But she's, she has this little balloon that staring back at her and winking at her and saying, hey, you know, you got this. You know, so to me, those little things as an artist, I try to include uh, very subtle, but hopefully making a, a big impact for people, you know. Every day is a new day, you know, and every day is a new day to make something out of your your life and your and whatever it is, you know, and we have an opportunity to be fortunate to to wake up and, 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 and tell ourselves, you know what, um, I have this new day where I can make a change. Bobby's mural is one of four throughout downtown Boise, all with empowering messages. A reminder, you are loved. It's okay to ask for help. Murals and window paintings, creative ways to reduce the stigma, to remind people if you are struggling, someone is always there at the Idaho Suicide Prevention Hotline. You can reach out anytime and you don't need to be suicidal to call. If you just need somebody to talk to, sometimes that's all we need. And um, for, for me to have, uh, you know, that available in our community, it's a big deal. And I think uh, I just jumped on it as soon as I got the opportunity. And I, I hope everybody and everyone that sees it uh, feels the same way uh, and feels like it brings a smile to, to them or anything positive in their day. You know, even just if they're walking by and see it and, and smile, it's, it's, to me, that's a big, that's the goal. Advertising agency Drake Cooper worked with the Idaho Suicide Prevention Hotline on this new marketing campaign at no cost. Every year, Drake Cooper chooses a nonprofit organization and helps them develop unique branding. And this couldn't come at a better time for the hotline because they are trying to change their branding, their messaging. They want people to know, even though it's part of their organization's name, you don't need to be suicidal to call them. So if you or someone you know is struggling and you just need someone to talk to, remember, Help is always available. Just call the hotline at 208 398 4357. It's where the Lewis and Clark expedition met the Nez Perce people, which has something to do with what it's called. But how do you say the name of this panhandle town? Is there something about Idaho you're curious about? Send us your Idaho related questions that could lead to the next feature story here on the 208. That number, 208-321-5614. Include your name and the hashtag, well, the 208.